ملا سنيوري قلنا هنيت كان وفق البنة لا تكتب يعني فلت بن فلت بن هنا نقول this does magic right دكتور غرام yes دكتور غرام how are you first of all good very good how are you guys very good we are so we are always very excited to come here and the stuff كيف تكتبوا هنا الناس we always yeah we always learn something what's that in your hand so, this is a magic pen. <laughs> it's uh, basically an elegant way of um, uh, sticking thousands of needles into somebody's face. Thousands. An elegant <laughs> way of... <laughs> cool. It's so like tattooing. Go ahead. Uh, tattoo. It's very similar. For your color. It's very similar. So, generally... Um, I don't know actually how many needles tattooists, uh, oh, no. tattooist well, pens have. Black, the black ink only one, but when you okay. color, it's you have more. So have more. yes, so it's and like you a tattoo. have less because the it's over a larger area. area. Exactly. Okay. Yes, pain free. Mm -hmm. um, uh, Is so that pain free? We apply some local anesthetic, okay. pretty much like okay. like tattooists do. Okay. Um, the concept of this pen is essentially. Um, inducing collagen production in our skin. So the skin has this really amazing ability to regenerate or heal itself mm -hmm. every time it's, it's damaged. So what we're doing is we're, we're damaging it in a controlled way. With the pen? We know, exactly. So we know exactly how deep we want to go, to what layer of the skin we want to go. And then with the needles, we kind of stamp out um, parts of the skin Mm -hmm. We damage them, the cells there die, and then the skin gets this signal to say, oh, I've been damaged, I'm going to start repairing myself. What about if I have damaged skin already? Well, it depends what kind of damage. So when you have something like a surgical scar or something like a, a, a bad graze or a bad cut, the layer of the skin that gets cut or damaged is very deep. It affects the basement membrane and generally the skin does start to repair itself, but in a, in, a, in a scarring manner. So it starts to produce a certain type of collagen, which is that scar white mm -hmm. that, that we see. Um, when you, when you damage, it, damage it in a controlled way, it produces another type of collagen, which is actually going to, to repair the skin and restore that uh, lack of, of volume. Mm -hmm. So that's what this pen does. I love it. What, what, what's collagen? Because not everyone knows what Okay, so collagen, collagen is. is something that everybody has in their skin and in other parts of their bodies. Youngsters have more. <laughs> Youngsters have more, <laughs> yeah, and they have more cells that produce more exactly. collagen. Um, essentially, it's a structural protein which gives you that tautness of the skin which mm -hmm. we lose over time. Mm -hmm. And together with elastin, you get that flexibility of the skin and that very nice kind of... In fact, before you introduce you, you can tie it with the pin that you can put in the skin and produce the collagen that you can put in the skin. Well, this is the one that you can put in the skin and you can put it in the skin and you can put it in the skin. So when you when I come for a consultation, what do you suggest before doing the treatment? You don't really have to do much before, there's, there's not much prep. Um, it's a treatment which we generally can do most of the year, you don't have to stop doing it in summer, obviously with caution and, and sunblock if we do it. Mm -hmm. um, you basically just have to come and apply some local anesthetic and, mm -hmm. and we can do the treatment. You have about one, two days downtime because you, you will be quite red. There's, oh, yes. a bit of, yeah, uh -huh. there's a bit of scabbing, a bit of bleeding sometimes. Mm -hmm but very, very fast What's recovery. What's the difference between that and mesotherapy? So, we spoke about Exactly, so uh, the depth, mesotherapy goes a little bit deeper. Mm -hmm. And, uh, and inject in. Exactly, with mesotherapy, we inject hyaluronic acid and other vitamins and proteins into the skin. Mm -hmm. Whereas this does more damage to the skin. So there's a lot more needle punctures. So there's a lot more
collagen induction uh -huh. of your own. Mm -hmm. We're not inserting much. Mm -hmm. I do use a serum on top, but the, the idea of this is to stimulate your own collagen to start mm -hmm. repairing the skin. Everybody as opposed can to mesopen. do mesopen? Everybody. Yeah, everyone, technically everyone can do it. Um, obviously, uh, we can't correct very deep lines with this. Um, I mostly use it for acne scars. It's great because a scar is damaged uh -huh. skin, which is yes. not controlled, right? That is good acne, yeah? I know so you I have these ice picks or yes. these rolling yes. deep scars. So what we do is so we damage that. that scar with all these little needles and we allow the skin to repair Even itself. Even again. men, I think. Yes, it's men. It's, for it's men. Actually, men. And it would be a magic, a magic uh, yes. equipment for people suffering. No, it's, it's acne amazing. Because yes. psychologically, acne mm -hmm. does does a lot of. For of sure, them. for sure. So acne is probably the most popular um, reason why people opt for mm -hmm. the for the mesopen. Then we also use it for stretch marks because again, a stretch mark is kind of a a scar on the on the skin. Mm -hmm. So again, we break that scar up mm -hmm. in a controlled fashion. Mm -hmm and then we wait for the skin to, to heal How itself. How long will the treatment take? Depends on the area, you know, we usually do either cheeks or um, stretch marks, abdominal, uh, thighs, depends on the area. I mean, it doesn't take longer than about 30 minutes. And is I'd there say. a particular area where you can't apply mesopen? I don't like to apply it on very thin skin, so like I'm very elderly. cautious around... Oh, yes. the elderly, you mean? Elderly, I mean, exactly. Okay. I, exactly. As I said, it's it's more for the younger skin. Mm -hmm. It's more for the skin that can actually produce that collagen mm -hmm. once you stimulate it. Mm -hmm. So we're looking at young people with acne scars, young people with stretch marks, post-pregnancy stretch marks, super responsive because they're fresh. They haven't had time to, to kind of solidify. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So so we get a contraction of that of that stretch mark and it's it gives really nice results. Can you do it just after pregnancy, like let's say two Yes, months yes, after there's pregnancy? no there's no contraindication once you're mm -hmm. you know, you've delivered your, your baby, it's there's no contraindication. After delivery obviously exactly. after pregnancy exactly. as such. No. Is it good for expression lines as well? Yes, it's or good. Smoker lips, for example. Yes, again. Uh, the deeper the line, the less effective it's going to be. So the deeper the wrinkle... That's why for acne it's, it's brilliant. Exactly. And for acne we like to combine mesotherapy. Mm -hmm. So we get under that scar, oh. we inject a little bit of hyaluronic mm -hmm. acid uh -huh. mm -hmm. that sits there under that scar and gives it support to lift it up. And then okay. with this we resurface the... So you can combine both uh -huh, treatments uh -huh, in yes. one. Yes, uh -huh. and uh -huh. that's, that's what I generally like to do, a combination. Because when you treat a problem with one single weapon, you're limited. When will you see the effects of... of um, the it takes therapy. a couple of weeks, generally. At the, uh, initially, you see you have a, a, a bit of uh, an increased blood flow, so you get that glow, you get rid of a little bit of that dullness on the skin. That's the first reaction mm -hmm. and then over a couple of weeks your body starts to produce that collagen and then you start to see this uh, mm -hmm. this very kind of rejuvenating effect and how often can you mm -hmm. apply it i'd say once a month generally we don't do a lot of things very regularly so you, we want to give skin time to to heal itself yes. because you don't want to True. do a treatment have your skin still quite sensitive and then damage it again so I'd say um, uh, once a month, I think is. And uh, do you have to apply it only on the face or any part anywhere, of the body? Anywhere, anywhere. Stretch marks or generally tummy. Anywhere, exactly. Buttocks. Mostly, it's obviously face, neck, and and décolleté, um, and then stretch marks are. Even the breast area. Breast, abdomen, breast, buttocks. Uh, 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 as that depends where where they. Where they it have is them. great because at least. Inna li had ghost, or for to call li iya trattamenta lekni unafu ke lekni li skar saha special met fladoloshenti uzaza kem tamel impact psikologico. Allura almin feya lekni uyisa 
um, yiji jam il-trattament biex inak kidok li scars il-hofor okay. u kemm qed tajdinna wkoll tista' tiġi kombinata mal mal mal, mal mezoterapi mal mezoterapi brilliant anzi tissuġġerixxi li jkun trattament um, fejn tikkombina dawn iż-żewġ trattamenti flimkien naħseb ikollok għax anke inti ka tiġi tagħmel trattament se jkollok il-ħmura so with with one treatment you combine both so, yeah. is there any aftercare for it um, your skin might be a little bit dry and mm-hmm. a little bit flaky so we generally just give you a repairing cream that you use for about a week and then once the skin has healed uh, nicely and and we're happy with that result you can go back to using your your regular products that you you use every day that's cool. perfect that is perfect